Hey guys, Jay Nasty here. What is up guys? In today's video, I'm going to talk about two assault rifles coming into the Call of Duty Advanced Warfare that we've never seen before. And also, um, for the, today's gameplay guys, it's a Black Ops nuclear gameplay in 6v6 domination. Hopefully you guys enjoy the Black Ops 2. Haven't had too much fun playing Ghost, so I switched to Black Ops 2 and I, I find it a little bit more enjoyable for me at least. So hopefully you guys don't mind. And if you guys would, drop a like. That'd be awesome. And if you don't follow me already, uh, make sure to follow me on Twitter. And like I said, if you're new to the channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button. So let's get into the commentary topic at hand. So if you guys didn't know this, Advanced Warfare is going to have two new assault rifles. One being a plasma rifle, which is kind of like, I don't know if you guys ever played Halo 2, but a lot of the guns were plasma and they pretty much shoot blue little bullets out of the gun and it looks kind of cool. I, I feel like a plasma sniper rifle would look really cool with like a bluish like a cool fire blue streak um like the sniper where the bullet travels the sniper smoke that's left behind i think that'd be badass if it was blue trail i think that'd be really really sick plasma rifles are kind of like a halo type thing in my opinion um and this gun that we're going to see here next which i'm going to talk about is a 3d printer rifle so what a 3d printer rifle is it's not actually made from a 3d printer it's already manufactured at the warehouse or wherever it may be but what makes it the 3D printer rifle is, is that the gun actually 3D prints its ammunition on the go um, in the weapons chamber. And I'm going to show you guys a pic right now. Should be on your screen. Now looking at this gun, I see that it has 173 out of 200. Um, and I'm assuming that's the ammo. And when I think about this is, I'm thinking that it could be like Titanfall. The gun could be like a Titanfall gun or maybe sledgehammer is going with the titan fall field where they give you enough ammo where you don't need scavenger and you don't need um bandolier or the extra the extra like perk slot that is in ghost i don't know what it's called but it gives you extra ammo so who knows maybe they're going to make it like that um and i think that's why a lot of people are saying it's like a Titanfall fall ripoff but you guys have to remember this game has been in production for a very long time so uh, maybe both both parties thought of this the idea around this exact same time who knows but overall a 3d printer rifle sounds really badass and uh, i'm kind of excited for it in call of duty advanced warfare also plasma rifles i think they'll be really really sick uh i just think if they make the streak the bullets blue and like a sniper streak blue i think it'd be really awesome and um hell even a, even like a yellow trail or a red trail would look really awesome in my opinion um, but that's really all that I want to talk to you guys today about is the two assault rifles that have been confirmed in Call of Duty Advanced Warfare and I'm kind of stoked for this game and I know a lot of people are not but uh, have faith my youngins have faith but I'll, I'll see you guys later thank you guys for watching hopefully you guys enjoy the Black Ops 2 tomorrow I'm going to talk about class setups and why they are sometimes really really important important to doing well in a video game or not in a video game but in Call of Duty where you have so many options with your perks and your kill streaks and stuff. I'm going to talk about that in tomorrow's video, and I think you guys will really, really enjoy it. And um, I'll, I'm going to show you guys of, of me uh, a show me of a game losing, right? And I'm going to show you the next game of me with an updated class setup and me just going crazy. So hopefully you guys enjoyed today's video. If we can hit 1,500 likes on that, that'd be awesome. Like I said, follow me on Twitter if you haven't, and if you're new, make sure to hit that subscribe button. I'll be giving a bunch of advanced warfare tips, and I'll be uploading some beast at beast. Whoa, whoa, stuttering when I said beast. Uh oh, that's not good. That's not good. Maybe I don't upload beast gameplays. But hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Like I said, peace out, slapbag, motherfuckers.